Hello Boundless Citizens is bound more and uh, this is a sixth part of Boundless United Chronicles. I haven't been around for a couple of weeks and now just time to catch up and see what people were doing around. I've seen some screenshots shared in the forum or Discord so I know I know that a lot of new things were built or the ones that were started are uh, finished. And I think I will start in the forest there. I've been showing the uh, Spanish build there. This is a lovely fantasy style house here and something a bit more modern there's some additions here and there okay let's check a look here can we walk through here Alright, that's a lot of gleam work here, chiseling and all. Oh, this is nice. And whose beacon is it? Well, you can see apparently it's a uh, Oh, pigs, of course. I knew that. I swear. <laughs> uh, so it's uh, definitely work in progress down there. On the outside it has... Uh, what's happening here? On the outside there's a front that's mostly ready. The one here is what I call a Spanish build. I showed it in one of the previous episodes, definitely once or twice. There are some small additions, but it's mostly the way it was. But let's check inside. Yes, there's progress in. Oh, yeah, that was just an empty cave the last time I was here. And we have the meditating person slash lizard here. <laughs> now one's got a lot of work around here. A lot of natural rock left as it was. And then just decorated with gold and some concrete everything in shades of blue which goes very well with gold color here Absolutely love this one here. And there will be more here. I assume this is just a, a preparation for further development. Unless, unless this is the idea, to just have a nicely sculpted uh, natural rock and nothing else. We will see in time. And off to, off to the neighbor. Now this one is really impressive. Beautiful. It looks great at night. Oh, 
you know what I love the way it's uh, merged with surroundings like this tree left not cut down hogging the building okay there's a bit of a climb here As you can see how the trees, the foliage is hugging and embracing the roof. It looks really good. Really nice cute stairs. And again really nicely merged with surroundings. Some terraforming down here to create a nice smooth transition between the cliff, the forest and into the actual house and yard or oh, look at that hearth looks really warming and welcoming ok let's take a look inside Great woodwork. Go downstairs. Oh, and we have a nice view here towards the uh, the Spanish build, the gold and blue temple. These are a bit narrow, so you can see as much but if we stand here you can definitely make out the shape of the bills across the water let's go back up oh yeah more stairs if we place ourselves higher And another flight of stairs. Okay, that would be the highest we can get. Oh no, just a bit more here. And oh yeah, and another view. That's the fireplace. and a view towards the forest so at this height is basically just a view of of treetops although where's the exit i'm officially lost oh no i have to go further downstairs don't i somewhere ah somebody help me no not downstairs i'm downstairs already exit's gonna be here yes okay that's my confusion resolved okay let's follow the path here so that leads to purse place definitely there's a branch going there towards the Spanish build but we will go here Oh, I actually never checked uh, who is the owner of this house. I know I met the person, just can't remember the name for life of me. Uh, Docker. Docker. Excellent build. And now off to Purse. This is the uh, the ruined part. Oh yeah, and the mushroom house. Shady cat, of course. Oh, I know, I remember now she said 
herself and her husband were working on a few things around. This one is not finished, but we have one here and look at it. Wow. That's how we use the blocks that you have in game in a creative way and you can get amazing results using really simple blocks like soil, sand, sponge and it really does look like a big mushroom <laughs> look at that chimney twisting around great style great work here definitely got to be one of my favorites around here oh and uh, yeah I've seen a screenshot of that, uh, of that one that's also Shady and her husband nice pool some terraforming done around fungi and plants grass changed to this uh, really vivid green color it might be one of the moss shades maybe let's just check that's deep green actually And now off to Nandor's tree house. And a couple of weeks ago, we were talking about him adding another layer uh, on top of the trees, and it seems to be ready. So let's just admire the entire project from the outside. before we eventually go inside what's this little oh my god that's a toilet <laughs> oh that's brilliant oh lads the seat oh that's great let's air the room a bit oh look it's really steamy <laughs> better cover that back okay so <laughs> oh that made my day but okay we have some mushrooms around is there another mushroom house here you had one there right yes oh yeah and there's another one here with different colors it's a really great motif in this place those mushroom houses that are actually a few of them with different color schemes and then also a lot of uh, mushrooms made of different blocks and materials that you can find around really great and there are a few different people building here so they kind of they kind of uh, work together with uh, this motif which is great okay back to uh, Nander's house let's look inside okay that's uh, is that a guest book yes it is there's a pen <laughs> yeah brilliant idea this, uh, yeah there's actually uh, just a glass sign put on top of that timber and then you have a book and you have a pencil yes, okay so paintings on the wall <laughs> onions, pods. Oh look, there's a cutting board. Well, basically a kitchen. A <laughs> bro! Oh, brilliant, really. Oh, cause Dunder, you're just a star. If it comes to a creative use of signs. just really really looks great all over 
outside inside okay let's climb this up 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 okay some nice view and now we can look down oh this area looks really great at night look at all those fungi glowing everything in green then we have a bit more orange yellowy orange colors here the same here Amazing. Oh, I love all the little decor done around. A bit of balcony here. We can go higher up. We are still a bit away from the top of the trees here. So up, 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 up. Are we there? Yes, that's the actual top. And when you look around, yes, we are level with most of the trees. Well, actually all of the trees. Some of them are just maybe a bit higher. And then we have a, a good opening here. Oh, let's actually check this spot, this part. Yes, okay. Alright, I will leave showing more for later for a different video, next episode. Otherwise you will have a, an hour... Oops! I missed the bridge. Otherwise you will have an hour video which would be most likely tiring to watch and then the final look towards what I was showing in the beginning and the build there and that's it for now thank you very much for watching and remember to stay boundless